All right, here we go, and we are live in Chartway Arena. Just got through with the introduction. It's time to go. Today's date is October 27, 2024. You are listening to Clifton Williamson. This is PK Sports. Today's matchup is versus Old Dominion University versus Christopher Newport. Exhibition game. It's time to get into it. Today's starting lineup for the Lady Monarchs is number zero, Cameron Hill. Number two, Samara Fields. Number seven, Kelsey Thompson. Number five, India Buford. And number 55, Brenda Fontana. Looking for a good one today. Right now, everybody's at center court, getting ready for the jump ball. Oh, yeah. And it's off. ODU gets the first tip off. India Buford takes it to the left side of the perimeter, swings it over down to the corner. She dishes it off to Brenda Fontana down on the block, gets a quick spin for two points. ODU gets that first bucket on that first possession. Christopher Newport with the ball down in that end. They bring it out to the top of the key. Just sets a pick. Dishes it off with an easy pass. Goes down to the corner. Easy three. Number 25, Alexa Lindsay. Over to you back on that end. India Buford for the three. Christopher Newport pushing it back down. Not really a pushing it type type team, but they're slow pace type team. Number five drives to the bucket, kicks it back out. So number 23, she kicks it to the corner, back to number five. Number five hits the three, Camilla. Oh, the U pushes it back down the court on their end already. Dishes it down to Brenda Fontana. Brenda Fontana for two points. Good for Newport, bring it back down their end. It's already getting into it. The energy is already there. Number five drives it to the bucket, gets another two points for Christopher Newport. It's tied up. First quarter, eight minutes. Brenda Fontana. They swing it. Great ball moving by ODU. But did not hit the three or air ball. There is a crowd in here. All uh, right, ODU taking the ball out. It was an air ball, but ODU gets the ball back. Swing it to the corner to number seven, Kelsey Thompson. They dish it down low, no foul call. Brenda Fontana gets the offensive rebound, kicks it back out to Samara Fields. Samara Fields get two screens set for her. Pulls up with the jumper from the perimeter. Missed shot. Christopher Newport bringing it back down. Number 25, Alexia Lindsay. Tied up for the ball, Brenda, number 23 from Christopher Newport. Number 25 drives to the bucket, almost loses it, falls down to the ground, she kicks it back out to the perimeter. Missed shot, missed three-pointer by Christopher Newport. ODU gets the rebound, pushing it back down the court. Already down to Brenda Fontana. Cameron Hill misses the layup. Christopher Newport swinging the ball, making great ball movement. She drives to the rack. An easy two points by number 25. Alexia Lindsay from Christopher Newport. ODU pushes the ball back down the court. India Buford at the top of the key. Delicia is calling the play from the sideline. India Buford takes it over to the right side of the perimeter. 
Brenda Fontana gets the ball in the corner, drives to the back, it kicks it back down to Cameron, but she misses the layup. Number 25, Christopher Newport bringing it down, driving to the basket. Foul call on number two, Shamaru Fields. Making a substitution, Simone Cunningham coming into the game. Number 25 getting two shots <clears throat> at the free throw line. Misses the first free throw. Score is CNU 11. ODU 7, six minutes, 20 seconds left in the first quarter. Corrections, <clears throat> score 9 7. They just changed it 9 7. Seeing you winning. <clears throat> Misses the second free throw. ODU gets the rebound. Brenda Fontana down below. Simone Cunningham <clears throat> almost gets the rebound. But misses it. Christopher Newport ball out on ODU. Haley bringing it down the court for Christopher Newport. She goes, dishes it off. Back down to number zero, she takes the three-pointer and misses it. India Buford with the rebound. India Buford forces the ball down to the corner. They dish it off. In the paint, two points for ODU. Seeing you pushes the ball down the court, swings it to the corner, but it is an air ball. And India Buford gets the rebound, throws it down the court. It is a turnover. Seeing you gets the ball back. Seeing you is pushing the ball down the court. Number zero drives to the rack. But gets it stolen from him. Out of bounds on ODU. Seeing use ball. Right now it's a pretty, pretty good pace game. Uh, seeing you is working the ball down low, getting to the rack. <clears throat> Both teams hitting their shots. <clears throat> Ooh, India Buford tries to drill it, drill it down to Simone, but it was a bad pass. She couldn't get to the pass. But they dap each other up, letting them know it's all good. Working on the next play. It's about the next play. Not just staying in that one play. Number two from Christopher Newport brings it down, brings it down the court. Haley. Right now, ODU is in a 3-2. Looking like a 3-2 trap. Jump ball. And it's working. They just got the ball. ODU's possession. Timeout on the floor. All right, and we are back. This is the first quarter at the four-minute mark. The score is nine to nine. It is tied up. ODU is moving the ball around. Um, they have made a couple of bad passes, but other than that, they've been taking good shots, getting to the rack, making their layups. Had a couple of missed layups. Same for Christopher Newport. It's a steady pace game, but we're looking for ODU to pick it up. Let's see what CNU can bring. Of course, in this game, CNU is the underdog. Seeing you ball, seeing you takes it out, passes it in. Right now, ODU is back in a man-to-man -man defense. Number two misses the layup. ODU gets the defensive rebound. Number one, Jaden Atchison taking the ball down the court. She swings it to Mariah. Mariah on the miss layup. 
Number two, bringing the ball down the court from seeing you. Seeing you swings it, swings it over to the left corner for a mid-range jumper. It's good. Two points to seeing you. The score is now 11 to nine, four minutes left. Simone Cunningham with the ball. She swings it over to Jaden. Swings it to number 23 in the corner. Good. Three-point field goal. Seeing you rotating, swinging the ball around. Pump fake. Back to the perimeter. Driving to the rack. Two points plus the foul. Going to the free throw line. Number zero. McKenna Snively. Shooting one shot. And the free throw is good. Seeing you up two. Oh, do you taking the ball out? Jaden Ashton gets the ball. Almost loses it. Say right there for her. Travel call on Jaden Atchison. Seeing you's ball. Didn't really expect it to be this close at this time, but that's what we're looking at right now. Seeing you takes the ball out at the top of the key. Two at the free throw line for seeing you. Number five comes up, gets the ball at the perimeter. 34 rolls down. Back to the top of the key for the three pointer. Missed shot. Comes off the rim hard. Donovan pushes the ball. Sarai dishes it over to the left. Number 23 tries to reverse layup, but misses it. Seeing you gets the rebound. Number 25 drives to the rack, gets the easy layup. Alexia Lindsay. Seeing you is now in a full court press. Pressing their guards. They get the ball to the middle to Simone Cunningham. Number one pulls up for the mid range jumper, but it is an air ball. Seeing you was now pushing the rock, picking up the pace. Another two points for number 34, Elizabeth Creed. Seeing you was pushing the ball. Now they are up six points, 18 12. So you're seeing you came to play today. Also, older you came to play too. Right now, the five on the court for ODU is Sarah, Simone Cunningham, India, and Mariah. Sarah bringing the court down, bringing the ball down. <coughs> Swing it over to Mariah. Simone Cunningham gets the ball at the top of the key. Swings it back over to Sarah in the corner. Simone Cunningham puts up the shot but misses it. Comes off hard. Out of bounds on ODU. Seeing you ball. Seeing you gets the ball, top of the key, swings it. She comes to set the pick, number 25, driving to the rack like she's been doing this whole game, but misses the layup. Number 24, number 24 for ODU, Michaela Brown gets the rebound. ODU pushes the ball down the court, but misses the corner three. Number five, bringing it down the court for Christopher Newport. Gets, goes to the rack for the reverse layup, and hits the reverse layup for another two points. 2012, CNU is winning first quarter. One minute and 40 seconds left. 
Mariah gets the ball, drives to the rack. Blocking foul call on CNU. Seeing you mix a substitution. Number four, Sidney Sherman coming into the game. Seeing you gets the ball in. ODU now in the full court press. Simone Cunningham guarding number three. The two number threes playing on each other. They switch. Number seven now guarding number three. They in the man to man. Gabby San Diego still with the ball in her hand, trying to make a decision. Number 23 from CNU takes the ball to the free throw line. Simone Cunningham gets the block and gets the ball back. Number five taking the ball down the court for ODU. Simone Cunningham gets the ball, almost makes a pass, but passes it down, passes it to the perimeter to India Buford. ODU now taking their time with the ball, not really forcing it. They get the ball down low for the two, almost two points. It bounces off the rim. India Buford gets the ball back, tries to lay up, but it does not go in. Out of bounds. No, foul call on number three, push. Simone Cunningham. That's her first foul. Alicia talking to the team from the side, telling them to watch the watch the slants. Foul called on White 24. Michaela Brown. They got a trap now on number three from CNU. She did not know what to do with the ball. CNU remains with the ball out on ODU. CNU takes the ball out. Number 21 gets the ball. Brendan Fontana playing defense. They switch. India Buford steps up, but they call a foul. Six seconds left in the first quarter. 2012, seeing you is in the lead. Number three going to the foul line, Gabby San Diego from Lorton, Virginia. First free throw is up and it's a miss. Second free throw up, and it is good. Number five pushing the ball down the court. Nisa Muhammad dishes it to number seven. Kelsey Thompson for the two-pointer to end the first, court, first quarter, 14-21. ODU is down seven, five fives. CNU, one foul, one team five. ODU, five team fives. Been a pretty good matchup so far. I didn't expect seeing you two come out with this type of energy, putting up this many points. 
Right now we're taking a break from PK Sports. We'll be right back. And we are back. <clears throat> Second quarter just beginning. ODU starts off with the ball. Brenda Fontana dumps it down to the down low to the paint. <clears throat> Turnover. First possession of the second corner by ODU. Seeing you ball. Seeing you bringing the ball down the court. Number three. Out on seeing you in India Buford with the quick hands. ODU sideline getting into the game, telling them to D up with their chant, D up chant. ODU's ball, Brenda Fontana taking the ball out. Number five and number seven in the backcourt. Nisa Muhammad and Kelsey Thompson. Brenda Fontana has the ball down low but loses it. Turnover from ODU, seeing you pushing the ball down the court. Number three swings it over to the right perimeter. Some good movement, some good motion by seeing you good, great space. And number five takes it to the rack, misses the layup. ODU gets the defensive rebound. Foul call on number five, seeing you. Simone Cunningham coming into the game. For number 24, Michaela Brown. Number seven for ODU taking the ball out, Kelsey Thompson. Almost gets it stolen, but ODU gets the ball back. Nisa Muhammad pushes it down. Brenda Fontana kicks it back out. Brenda Fontana at the three point line drives in, dumps it down to India Buford for two points and a foul. ODU bench gets hyped. India Buford going to the free throw for one shot. India Buford with one shot. Out on seeing you, ODU gets the ball back. Nisa Muhammad taking the ball out. India Buford coming to get the ball. Dishes it down to Nisa Muhammad in the corner. Nisa finds Brenda Fontana in the paint for an easy two points, easy layup. Seeing you brings the ball down. Not as fast paced as. ODU slowing it up more. ODU back in the 3-2, no longer in the man. Seeing you trying to find a way to penetrate. Right now just dribbling. She finds her way down to the block. That is a travel, yep. Travel called on number 24. For seeing you, ODU's ball. Twenty-one eighteen, seeing you in the lead. Eight minutes and fourteen seconds left in the second quarter. India Buford taking the ball out. Three guards in the back court. She throws it over to Nisa Muhammad. Nisa Muhammad finds Brenda Fontana in the down low. Brenda kicks it out to number seven. She misses the three-pointer. Time out on the floor for Christopher Newport. Oh, do you finding their way back into the game? Starting to pick up the pace. Looking a lot better, looking more alive. Getting more into it. The bench is definitely getting into the game with their chant on the side, D up. Let's see what seeing you can do. Can they hold them off? Oh, do you looking to get back into the lead? First game in the Chartway Arena for the women's basketball. Monarchs, Lady Monarchs. We are back from the timeout. Eight minutes left in the second quarter. ODU gets the ball. Brenda Fontana at the block. Gets it back out to India Jones. She kicks it to number two. 
Fields. Fields gets the rebound. Defensive rebound. Foul call on seeing you. India Buford taking the ball out. ODU needed that three pointer. Tied up 21 21. ODU now getting more into it. Brenda Fontana gets the ball at half, half court. They're breaking the press. Fields kicks it down over to number seven, Kelsey Thompson. She drives in, hits the mid range jumper. <clears throat> Seeing you pushing the ball, trying to get the ball down quicker than ODU can get back on defense. Seeing you and ODU get tied up for the ball. Jump ball. Blue ball, seeing you. Now we're getting a little physical. Seeing you taking the ball out. Number two, Haley Kellogg. Seeing you runs that inbound play. She can't find anybody. She dishes it off to number 33. Lobs it. Number 24 drives to the rack. Kicks it back out to number 33. <coughs> out on seeing you, ODU ball. Seven minutes left in the second quarter. ODU winning 23-21. Fields takes the ball out. Gets it to Buford. Fields goes, goes down to Brenda Fontana. Back to India Buford to Fontana. Swings it. Great ball movement. Misses the corner three, Fields misses the corner three. Out on ODU, singing U's ball. Singing U taking that time, bringing the ball down the court. <clears throat> no sense of urgency. Six minutes left in the second quarter. 20 seconds on the game clock. Number 14 sets the pit. She loses the ball, tied up once again. She'll be ODU's ball, which is it, which it is. Seeing you got the ball last tie up, last jump ball. Fields gets the ball, driving it down, kicks it out to Brenda Fontana, kicks it down to Brenda Fontana. Number seven drives to the rack for that and one. Number seven, Kelsey Thompson, another bucket. ODU is now picking it up. 25-21, now in the lead. Substitution made, India Buford coming out. Number 30 coming in, Amaya Fielder for the Lady Monarchs. Amaya Fielder from Philadelphia. Mississippi. Kelsey Thompson, one shot at the free throw line. And it's good. 26-21, Lady Monarchs up five points. Second quarter with six minutes and 20 seconds left. Seeing you can't seem to find a bucket at this point. Number 20 drives to the rack for a floater on the corner for a two, but she misses it. Seeing you gets the offensive rebound. ODU playing great defense. Seeing you gets the ball back at the top. She calls a play, three seconds left on the play clock. Almost gets the steal, shoots. Ball does not touch the rim. ODU, ball, Lady Marnards get the ball. Lady Monarchs playing good defense. Kelsey Thompson finds Fields. They go back and forth. Fields drives to the mid-range. Corner mid-range, another foul call. Fields going to the free throw line. Mm 
Shamal Fields Field shooting two shots. First free throw up. It is a miss. Second shot. It's up. And it's good. Turnover by seeing you. Fields gets the ball back at the top of the key. Pump fakes, drives to the rack. Another two points and a foul. And one. Going back to the free throw line once again. 29-21, Lady Monarch is winning with five minutes and 33 seconds left in the second quarter. Free throw made, seeing you gets the ball, bringing the ball down the court. ODU is in a, a press right now, full court press, full court man-to-man -man press. They're trapping. to you ball how do you swinging the ball at the top of the key fields gets the ball takes the three-pointer it's no good seeing you gets the defensive rebound pushing the ball down the court still on the perimeter swinging it on perimeter comes up set the pitch she drives to the Free throw line, dishes it down to the corner. Number 14, Ella hits the mid-range jumper. 30-23, seeing you down. Seven points. Thompson kisses to Fontana, finds number 30 in the corner for the three. She misses it. Kelsey Thompson gets the offensive rebound and puts it back up. Another two points for the Lady Monarchs. Seeing you swinging the ball, making some good moves. Lady Monarchs playing good defense, tips the ball out on ODU. Seeing you's ball. Cameron Hill, India Buford coming in into the game. Good D by any of Buford. She tips it and scrambling for the ball. Fields gets the ball back. Another steal by the Lady Monarchs. India Buford gets the ball back in her hand. Cameron Hill coming up to set a pick. India Buford drives to the rack, right side of the rack, lays it up. Another foul call. 34 23. India Buford for the bucket. Three minutes and 54 seconds left in the second quarter. India Buford, one shot at the free throw line. It bounces off hard. India Buford tries it, gets her own rebound. Ball gets stuck in the corner of the basket. The ball is now, goes to CNU. And CNU takes the ball out. Number one, Maya Wilson brings the ball down the court. She loses it, and it falls into India Buford's hand. India Buford kicks it to the corner to number 30 for the three. Amaya Fielder hits the three-pointer, 37-23. Three minutes left in the second quarter. Christopher Newport tries to drive to the rap, but gets it stripped. They go down for the easy layup, fast break point. Number 23, Mariah Clayton. Mariah Clayton is from Mesquite, Texas. Freshman, 5'10 forward. 
39-23, ODU is starting to pull away, just like we expected. Monarchs break the huddle. Back onto the court. Seeing you taking the ball out. Number three, Gabby San Diego. <clears throat> ODU in the full court press. They're trapping, full court trap. With Nisa Muhammad at the top. Number 30, Hamad Fielder. On number 15 at the top of the key. Seeing you, number 23, takes the mid-range jumper, misses it. Foul call. Foul call on ODU, number five. Camilla going to the free throw line for two free throws. First free throw up, and it's a mate. The score is 40-24. She gets the ball for the second free throw. Second free throw up. Bounces on the rim, but it is a mate. Cameron Jones taking the ball out for ODU to get the ball back down the court. Number 23. Mariah Clayton pushing the ball down the court. Pushing foul. Called. She got to the bucket, made the layup. And the bucket did not count. Oh, the bucket did count. Bucket is good. Mariah Clayton going to the free throw line. Shooting two shots, Mariah Clayton. As everybody quiets down in the arena, Mariah Clayton puts up the first shot, and the first shot is good. Maria Clayton, I'm sorry. Maria Clayton gets the ball, takes the second shot, and it's good. Seeing you really isn't finding anything on offense right now. They've been at the uh, 20 point mark for a while, trying to get trying to get some points on the board. But the Lady Monarchs are playing great D. Nisu Muhammad pushing the ball down the court again. Finds Fielding in the corner for another three. 45 25, just like that. The Lady Monarchs are up 20 points. Seeing you almost loses the ball, but gets the ball down in the paint for two points, 27 to 45. Lady Monarchs in the lead. Nisu Muhammad looking to do something with the ball, almost loses it. She kicks it to Cameron. Cameron kicks it out to Clayton. Clayton drives in for the layup, but misses the layup. Number 23 for San Yu pulls the three from the top of the key, but misses it. Fitzgerald on the rebound for the Lady Monarchs. Clayton passes it to Nisa Muhammad. Carry call on Nisa. San Yu ball. One minute, 13 seconds left in the second quarter. Yeah. 
seeing you gets an easy bucket down at the block for a short mid-range jumper. She could have did a layup, but she chose to take the jumper. Clayton with the ball. Sarah with the ball at the top of the key. Brenda Fontana looking to do something. She comes to set the pick. Marie misses this misses the easy two pointer. Good defense by the Lady Monarchs to get the ball back. Pushes it down the court for a fast boy, fast break point. Gets the two points, lays it up. Score is 47-29 with a running clock. 14 seconds left in the second quarter. Lady Monarchs looking to go into halftime with a great lead. Uh, seeing you still taking that time with the balls. The time runs down. Three seconds left, two seconds, one second. Take a final shot, and it is a brick. Oh, Lady Monarchs in the lead, 47-29, going into halftime. They're doing great. Picked up the pace, definitely picked up the pace um, in that second quarter from what it looked like in the first quarter as they run back into the locker room, seeing you. Um, definitely going to look for a way to close that gap, but the way, they like, the, way the Lady Monarchs are playing, the gap could get bigger. Let's see what happens. We'll be back after this. Thank you for listening to PK Sports. All right, and we are back. Ten seconds left until we start the second half. Once again, Lady Monarchs came out in that second quarter and really picked up the pace and took themselves up to take the lead. Score now 47-29. Ready to get back into this game. The starting five coming out into the half is the same starting five that started the game. Let's get into it. Jones taking the ball out. I mean, I'm sorry. Cameron Hill taking the ball out. Cameron Hill gets the ball stolen. Seeing you taking the ball down the court. Seeing you rotating the ball. Jump ball starting off. Possession of the ball goes to Guess they're trying to figure it out. Seeing you. Seeing you is now in possession of the ball after the jump ball, which means ODU gets the next jump ball. Fields come up to play defense on number three. For seeing you. Oh, to you back in the 3 2 zone. Defensive rebound by Odie, by the Lady Monarchs. Buford gets the rebound. Fields with the ball in her hand. Kiss at the hill. Offensive foul on Cameron Hill, CNU's ball. Gabby bringing the ball down, running that point guard for CNU. She kicks it to number 25. She backs him down, backs Buford down for the two points. Scores 47-31 with eight minutes left in the third quarter. Fields, kicks it to Fontana. Fontana tries to take it in, but it bounces off her foot. Turnover, seeing you with the ball in their hand. Almost loses it, but out on Fontana. Seeing you is still in possession of the ball. Both teams having a little trouble with the ball after uh, coming into the second half. Brenda Fontana gets her hands on the ball and is out. 
seeing you still has the ball. Substitution, Simone Cunningham and Clayton coming in. Mariah Clayton. Fontana again playing some great defense. Gets her hands on the ball. Out on Brenda Fontana. Seeing you still in the possession of the ball. Brenda Fontana getting physical down there. They make a switch. Kelsey Thompson playing good defense. Simone Cunningham. Seeing you trying to find their way to the bucket. She throws up a hook shot. Miss Simone Cunningham with the defensive rebound. Buford bringing the ball down the court. Simone Cunningham sets the picks and rolls to the basket. She find India finds Fontana for the layup. Two points for the Lady Monarchs. Seeing you pushing the ball down the court. Pump fakes, kicks it out to the perimeter. She drives to the left side of the basket for two points. A floater off of the backboard. ODU already down the court. She goes for the layup. Another two points by Clayton. Mariah Clayton. Mariah Clayton playing defense. Good block. And she gets the, the steal. Kicks it to Buford. Buford hits the reverse layup but misses it. Foul called on number five from Christopher Newport. Mariah Clayton going to the free throw line. Seven minutes, 20 seconds left in the third quarter. Lady Monarchs up by 18. Score is 51-33. Mariah Clayton at the free throw line. Simone Cunningham and Fontana down to get the rebound. Lined up to get the rebound. Mariah Clayton hits the first free throw. Shooting one more free throw. Mariah Clayton takes her time and hits the second free throw. Swish. Simone Cunningham is on it, playing defense. Seeing you is trying to get the ball down the court. They're, tra they're trapping them. And it is a jump ball, and it is in possession of ODU, the Lady Monarchs. Lady Monarch take the ball out. Number seven, Kelsey Thompson gets the ball in her hand. Driving to the rack. Simone Cunningham gets the rebound. And gets the two points. Technical foul on somebody. On blue. Number five. Kelsey Thompson taking one shot for the technical. Not sure what they called the tech for, but they called the technical foul. Team technical foul. Kelsey Thompson taking two shots. First free throw up. It's a mate. 56 33. Second shot up, and it's a mate. 57 33, seven minutes left in the third quarter. ODU gets the ball. She 
Fields kicks it to Fontana with a Euro to the basket, and she gets fouled. Oh, no, they caught the bucket off. Bucket did not count. Simone Cunningham gets the ball back off the inbound, misses a layup, but gets it back, puts it back into the bucket for another two points. 59-33, six minutes left in the third quarter. Seeing you trying to get the ball down the court, but the Lady Monarchs are playing great defense. Fontana down low in the paint. Foul call on Fontana. Seeing you making a substitution, getting some fresh legs out on the court. Cameron Hill coming into the game for Brenda Fontana, who played some great defense, hustling off the court. Seeing you first free throw up, number 21 at the free throw line. Hannah makes her first free throw. Second free throw up, and it's good. Score is 59-35, six minutes, 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Kelsey Thompson bringing the ball down the court now. Some great guard play with the Lady Monarchs. Pulls up at the free throw line, and it's good by Fields for another two points. Simone Cunningham playing good defense, stepping up, getting the ball back. For a steal, a Euro to the basket, another two points. Fields shakes her head, letting them know that, yeah, they here. Fields playing defense on number two for CNU. Haley bringing the ball down the court. CNU is trying to find the basket, but Lady Monarchs are playing great defense. Number five for CNU get to the basket and gets it up for two points and gets five. The score is 63-37. Lady Monarchs. Camilla going to the free throw line. Her first shot up and it's good. One point added to seeing you score. Mariah Clayton bringing the ball down the court. Hands it off to Fields. Cameron Hill rolled to the basket, but it got stolen by seeing you. Seeing you pushes the ball down the court. Looking for somebody down low. But Cameron Hill is all on that. She swats it out of bounds. Seeing you's ball. Seeing you passes the ball in for a mid-range jumper and misses it. Rebound by Sarah. She throws it down to Fields. Fields finds Hill. Hill. Easy two points. Assist from Samara Fields. Sarah with another steal. Mariah Clayton coming down the court, puts up the shot, but misses it. Fields. Tries to get this still, but a foul call, pushing foul. <laughs> Lady Monarch is definitely coming out, bringing the energy better than what they came out in the first quarter. Third quarter, five minutes left, five minutes, 12 seconds. Lady Monarch's up 65-38. Sarah playing good defense, gets her hands on the ball. But seeing you gets the ball back, drives to the rack. Double dribble call, ODU's ball. Number 24, Michaela Brown coming in, timeout on the floor. The Lady Monarchs definitely bringing the energy, just like I just said in this third quarter, four minutes, 54 seconds left. 
in the third quarter. The score is 65-38. Easily with another three-pointer, they can go up 30 points. Um, great ball movement. Great defense. Definitely great defense. Simone Cunningham coming out, getting their hands on the ball. Brenda Fontana coming out, getting their hands on the ball. They're playing great team defense. And seeing you is having difficulty getting the ball to the rack. So if older you can keep it up, they'll be able to play a great game. Coming out of the full timeout, number one, Jaden Ashton taking the ball out. Fields gets the ball in her hands. Tries to push it down the court, but loses the ball. A turnover by Fields. Jaina Atchison playing defense on seeing you. Number 20 goes behind her back. Number 20, DeCoy is from New Jersey. Seeing you finds the ball down low. Foul call. Foul called on Fields. Number 24 from seeing you gets the ball up. First free throw, and it's good. Emma O'Connor from Centerville, Virginia. Freshman, 6 1 forward. They call him Nisa on the sideline. Nisa going to the table to come in. Fields get the ball in their hand. Looking to get past the defender. Calling out a play. Cameron Hill comes up to set the pick. She dishes it down to Michaela Brown. Michaela Brown gets the ball, makes a power move to the rack. Another two points for the Lady Monarchs. Great rotation on defense. Fields, active hands, gets the steal. Kicks it to number one for the layup. Jada Atchison, another two points. Three minutes and 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Timeout called by seeing you. The score is 69 40, third quarter, three minutes and 42 seconds left in the third quarter. All right, coming back from the timeout. Seeing you taking the ball out. Seeing you a stat, they break the stat. ODU, the Lady Monarchs and man defense. Seeing you looking to get the ball down to the paint. Misses the layup. Cameron Hill with the rebound. Throws it back to Sarah. Sarah bringing the ball down the court. Pulls up for the mid-range jumper. Swish. Another two points. The score is 71-40. Three minutes and 15 seconds left in the third quarter. Seeing you swinging the ball at the perimeter. Number 42 drives to the basket. Sarah Pritz, but gets it knocked out of her hands. It bounces off of her knee. Lady Monarch's ball. Jada Ashton taking the ball out for ODU. Jada Ashton tells Nisa to go down to the corner. Ball is at the perimeter for the Lady Monarchs right now. Nisa Muhammad running the baseline. Jaden Atchison gives her a quick jazz step, crossover, pulls up for the jumper. It falls short. Michaela Brown gets the rebound, gets it blocked. White ball. Out. I'm seeing you. 
ODU. Nisa Muhammad takes the ball out. Nisa lobs it to Michaela Brown, bounces off her foot, seeing you recovers it, recovers, recovers the ball. Turnover from Michaela Brown. Number 42 spins to the rat, but turns the ball over. Nisa Muhammad lobs it to Cameron Hill. Cameron Hill comes to the corner, mid. The mid corner. Nisa Muhammad calls out Cameron Hill to come set the pit. But she doesn't come. Swings it to Jada Atchison on the perimeter. Jaden sw swings it back to Nisa Muhammad. Nisa at the top of the key swings it to Sarah. Sarah kisses it down to Michaela Brown, but seeing you gets the hands on the ball. Takes it back down the court for two points, 71-42. One minute, 50 seconds left in the third quarter. Nisa Muhammad dumps it down to Cameron Hill at the block. Cameron Hill trying to get the foul call. Talking to the ref right now. Letting her know that she's all on her arm. Substitution made. Number 30, Hamaya Fielder coming in for Sarah. Nisa Muhammad kicks it down to Cameron Hill. In the paint, Cameron Hill turns around and lives it up for another two points. Good bucket. Seeing you already down the court. Number one drives to the rack. Maya Wilson for two points. The score is 73-44. ODU up, third quarter. A minute and 18 seconds now. Fielder for the three in the corner. Michaela Brown gets the rebound. Bodies her with a power move, but misses the layup. Seeing you gets the rebound. Seeing you already down the court. Finds a way to the basket, but Nisa Muhammad playing great and tough defense. Michaela Brown gets the rebound. Nisa Muhammad pushing it down the court. Going to the rack. A bucket and two points. Tough bucket by Nisi Muhammad to the right. Nisi Muhammad and one. 75-44. Nisi Muhammad at the... Gets one shot at the free throw. And it's good. 76-44. 50 seconds left in the third quarter. Seeing you swinging the ball at the perimeter, looking for something to do with it. Punks fakes at the corner three. She probably should have took that shot to get some points on the board. Cameron Hill dishes it to Nisa Muhammad. Lady Monarchs with the ball in the hand. Jaden Addison drives to the rim but loses it. Gets it back. Jump ball call. Jump ball call. Seeing you gets the ball back. Number one, McKenna taking it out. Number 30 bringing the ball down the court. Charlotte from Boone, North Carolina. Seeing you was having a hard time. Um, getting the ball down low. Um, she forces it up, number 42. Gets two points, 10 seconds left. Nisha Muhammad, easy layup at the bucket. Easy layup, easy two points. To end the third quarter, Lady Monarchs winning. 32-point deficit going into the fourth quarter. What we really want to know is if the Lady Monarchs can keep this up <clears throat> throughout the season. Uh, of course, throughout the season, they're going to have to pick up their pace and going to have to play a little harder as their competition gets better. <clears throat> All right, start of the fourth quarter. Everybody back on the court.
Nisi Muhammad with the ball in the perimeter. India Buford calling for the ball. Brennan Fontana comes down. Spins away for two points. Marie gets the rebound. Bucket for two points. Seeing you shoots the floater, the floater. Sorry about that. Misses it. Another fadeaway. Missed. She tries to save the ball. She does save the ball. Passes it right to India Buford. India Buford bringing the ball down the court. You could definitely tell the pace is slowing down for the Lady Monarchs. Running some time out. India Buford kicks it out the fielder for the corner three. Marie gets the rebound and puts it back up for two points. Number 14 for CAU. Takes one dribble for the mid-range jumper at the free throw line. Ella for two points. <clears throat> Nisa Muhammad kicks it to Sarah Fitzgerald for the three points foul call. The score is 85-48. Eight minutes, 19 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Substitution made by the Lady Monarchs. Fields, Brenda Fontana, and Kelsey Thompson now on the court. First free throw made by Sarah Pritz from Burke, Virginia. 5'11", freshman. Second free throw put up, and it's good. Substitution made by seeing you captains. Kelsey Thompson taking the ball down the court. ODU looking <clears throat> to kick the ball to the corner for Brenda Fontana. Brenda Fontana misses the three-pointer, gets her own rebound. Fields at the top of the key, brings it around to the baseline and lays it up for another two points. <clears throat> Brenda Fontana playing tight defense. Marie, call foul, foul call on Marie. That's her second foul. Cameron Hill coming in for Marie. Number 50, Jessica at the free throw line puts her first free throw up. It is good. The score is 87-51, seven minutes, 34 seconds left. In the fourth quarter. <clears throat> Second shot put up, and it's good. India Buford speeding down the court, kicks it to Brenda Fontana. Fontana tries to kick it to Hill down low, but gets it stolen. Feels all on it, but it goes out of bounds. And she taps the ball, seeing you ball. India Buford playing defense. Seeing you sets of picks, drives to the rack, gets two points for a tough layup. 
India Buford on the perimeter by herself. Punk fakes. Lady Monarchs holding the ball. Brenda and Cameron come to set the pick at the top of the key. For Kelsey Thompson layup, but she misses the layup. Seeing you pushes the ball down the court. Punk fakes looking for the open three, but she drives to the rack for the layup. Number one, Maya Wilson from Murphy, North Carolina, guard, 5'8", sophomore, takes it in for two points. The score is 87-56, six minutes and 31 seconds left in the fourth quarter. The Lady Monarchs definitely came to play, definitely pulling away. All right, after that break, after that timeout, Lady Monarch is coming back into the court. Simone Cunningham, Fields, Cameron Hill, Kelsey Thompson, and India Buford. Fields taking the ball out. Fields bringing the ball down the court. Cameron Hill points to Simone Cunningham. We're going the opposite side of the court. Kelsey Thomas, Kelsey Thompson swip, swings it to Buford. Fields dumps it down to Simone Cunningham. Tough bucket with a strong move, strong spin by Simone Cunningham. Two points. 89-56, six minutes left in the fourth quarter. Seeing you bringing the ball down the court once again. <clears throat> Still having difficulty getting the ball to the rack. But finding a way to put points onto the board. Surprisingly, they scored 56 points. Simone Cunningham with a hand in the face of the shooter. Great defense. ODU gets the rebound. Kicks it over to Kelsey Thompson, but she loses the ball. Out of bounds. CNU captain's ball going in the other direction. India Buford takes a jab at the ball for the steal. Seeing you not really getting much motion on offense, a lot of standing around. They just have four players stacked on the baseline. Lady Monarchs definitely got some swag on the court and playing tough today. Five minutes and 14 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Seeing you ball. ODU. In the full court, man to man. Seeing you throws the ball away. Lady Monarch's ball. Kelsey Thompson taking the ball out. Fields bringing the ball down the court. Fields crossing over, looking for Kelsey Thompson. Kelsey swings it over to Buford, back to Kelsey as she slashes to the rack. Ball gets stuck in the side of the rim. Timeout, full timeout, called by the Lady Monarchs. Four minutes, 50 seconds left in the fourth quarter. 89-56, Lady Monarchs winning. I guess Delisha is, is upset right now. <clears throat> it's possible that the Lady Monarchs could put up 100 points.
I don't see why they couldn't and why they wouldn't be a- be able to, especially with seeing you making the turnovers. ODU definitely cut down on their turnovers. First horn, Lady Mona is getting ready to break the huddle. Seeing you captains breaking the huddle, getting back into the court. Haley taking the ball out, finds number 20. Decoys. India Buford playing tight defense. Lady Mona is chanting D up from the sideline. Number 20 crosses over, takes it to the rack, blows the layup. Seeing you gets the rebound, kicks it back out to the top of the key. Kicks it to the corner, drives, shoots the floater, air ball. Charging foul, call on number 20, the cause from New Jersey. Bills calling for somebody to come back down the court. All the Lady Monarchs came back down the court. Fields bringing the ball down, calling out their play. Tries to hands off, hands it off to Buford. Kelsey Thompson with the ball on the left side, on the right side of the perimeter. India Buford kicks it down to Simone Cunningham for the easy layup. Score is 91-56. Three minutes and 50 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Lady Monarchs making some substitutions. Looking like Nisu Muhammad and two other players, Jordan Addison and Sarah coming in. Another foul call. That looked like a tap foul. Barely even touched her. <clears throat> Fields, Buford, and Kelsey Thompson coming off the floor. Well deserved break. First free throw up, and it's good. Nisi Muhammad bringing the ball down the court. Jordan Atchison with the ball in their hand. Great, great motion, great moving around without the ball from the Lady Monarchs. Jordan Atchison pulls up for the mid-range jumper. I believe in a, in a legal screen card on number three, Simone Cunningham. Simone Cunningham has four fouls. Marie coming in for Simone Cunningham. Looking to see if ODU can put up 100 points. Score is 91-58, three minutes and 20 seconds, 25 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Nisi Muhammad gets taken to the rack, but number 20, Decoys misses. Nisi Muhammad pushes it down to Jordan Atchison for the mid-range jumper. She misses it. Seeing you gets the defensive rebound, swings it to the corner, the left corner, back to the top of the key. Not much moving on that baseline from seeing you. A lot of hand, active hands from the Lady Monarchs. Blocked by the Lady Monarchs.
See you taking the ball out. Don't sit down for the turnaround layup, but misses it. Nusa Muhammad kicks it to Jordan Addison, Addison for the easy two points. Dumps it off to Jordan Addison. I'm sorry, not kick it. Dumps it off to Jordan Addison. Nisi Muhammad playing great defense on the perimeter. CNU swings the ball around. Drives in for the mid-range jumper. Misses it. Nisi Muhammad pushing the ball. Kicks it. Passes it to Sarai. Sarai calling the shots at the top of the key. Passes it to Marie. At the left side of the perimeter, Joy Addison comes over, drives, dumps it to Cameron Hill. Cameron Hill gets an easy look at the basket for another two points. 95-58, only five points away from 100. I believe they can pull it off. Seeing you gets a three-point field goal, 61-95, one minute and 30 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Half timeout call, 30 second timeout call by the Lady Monarchs. Which means they stand on the court. Misha Muhammad calls the play, one minute left. Some, a lot of screening going down on um, down low in the paint. Nisi Muhammad still with the ball at the top of the key. Finds Sarah in the corner for the three. Misses it. CNU gets the defensive rebound, pushing it down the court. Drives to the basket. The layup falls short. Marie gets the rebound. One minute, One minute left in the fourth quarter. Sarah with the ball at the top of the key. Fitzgerald comes to set the pick, rolls to the basket, dumps it off to Marie. Marie gives her the shoulder, lays it up for two points. 97-61, the Lady Monarchs off of 100 from by three points. Timeout call by the captains. Full timeout. Once again, this is PK Sports. You are listening to Clifton Williamson. We are here live at Chartway Arena. 41.7 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Lady Monarchs beating the CNU captains 97 to 61. End of the timeout. Lady Monarchs and the captains back on the court. 41 seconds left in the full quarter. Seeing you looking to get the ball to the basket. Forces it down low. Foul call on the floor. She drives right into the double team. 29 seconds left. Foul called on number 30, Amaya Fielder. Shooting two. First free throw up, and it's a miss.
Second free throw. Bounces out the back of the rim. It's a miss. Nisa Muhammad pushing the ball down the court. With 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Lady Monarch still playing with intensity to the last second. Nisi Muhammad gets the ball at the top of the key and holds it. Eight seconds left. Nisi Muhammad crosses over and they're letting the time run down. The Lady Monarchs gets the win by a big deficit, 97-61. Great game. We appreciate you tuning in to Clifton Williamson with PK Sports. Stay tuned for the next broadcast.